Welcome to Electrocute, where we share some of our favorite crafting electronic products. My name is Dia. I'm Sparkfun's textile specialist. And I'm Nick, creative technologist. And today, we'd like to share one of our softest soft circuit materials, conductive yarn. Our conductive yarn is an 80-20 blend of polyester fibers and stainless steel, and it's in a great weight for knitting and crocheting projects. Conductive yarn is very different from conductive thread. It's very high resistance, so it's not a great way to directly connect components unless they're very close together. That resistance makes it great for sensing them. We've seen conductive yarn used to make conductive gloves, pom-poms, tassels, and stretch sensors, which we've used in our project today. We crocheted a tube of conductive yarn several inches long. You can also use a circular knitting machine for this. You can see that the resistance is high when the tube is held loosely because the stainless steel fibers in the yarn aren't in much contact. When you stretch the sensor out, the resistance drops dramatically because you're pulling the stainless fibers into closer, tighter contact. This change in resistance makes it possible to measure when and how much the sensor is being stretched, which can be a lot of fun to apply to body movement. We've sewn our sensor into a fabric cuff and connected it to the LilyPad Arduino and some WS2812 LEDs. We thought we'd apply this technology to a little problem our friend Greg has been having. You see, it's bulking season, which we here at Electrocute know a lot about. And while Greg has been putting in a lot of hours at the gym, eating cardio shakes, long-sleeved winter clothes are making it hard for people to see how sick his pythons are getting. So we made a bicep sensing cuff that will help Greg direct people towards the gun show. Seriously? Shh, Greg, you need this. Flex! See? That's really boring and unimpressive, and nobody can see your muscles at all. Which way is the gun show, Greg? Well, can't find it. Now where is the gun show? Ooh, two tickets, please. Can I go? Thanks, Greg. If you've got any questions about conductive yarn, products you'd like to see us feature, or just want to know why Greg's been skipping leg day, hit us up in the comments and we'll answer your question there or in the next video. And we've got a few questions from the last video. We did get a lot of questions about my ring. I've been married about six and a half years, uh, but we never found a wedding band that was comfortable and it feels really weird to wear two rings anyways, so I just kept wearing the engagement ring alone. We brought it up because I get asked about it pretty frequently, because there are a lot of close-ups of my hands in videos and tutorials. So. There you go. Now, user Sleepwalker3 also asked whether I've lost a bunch of weight since we started shooting these videos. Thanks, Sleepwalker. Uh, did you know there are 2,000 calories in a bag of Cool Ranch Doritos? And did you know you're not supposed to eat them all at once? User Tony Galati also asked, and I hope I pronounced that right, I would like to see a demo of using the lily pad and LED strip hooked together. How would you power it? Ask and ye shall receive, Tony. <laughs> 